from Arizona's southern deserts to its rugged north country, most famous for its crowning glory, the Grand Canyon. The Grand Canyon is recognized worldwide as one of the Earth's most awe-inspiring landscapes. 277 miles long, 18 miles wide, and in some places, over a mile deep. Over millions of years, the Colorado River sculpted this southern edge of the massive Colorado Plateau. On his visit in 1903, President Teddy Roosevelt declared, In the Grand Canyon, Arizona has a wonder unparalleled throughout the rest of the world, the one great sight which every American should see. The Grand Canyon has captivated man's imagination since its earliest visitors 12,000 years ago. For many ancient cultures, the canyon served as a gateway to the afterlife. The first Europeans to encounter the canyon were Spanish conquistadors in the 1500s on their quest for cities of gold in the Americas. Despite their boldest attempts, the Spanish armies were forced to turn back empty-handed. During the 1800s, American pioneers confronted the canyon on their journey to the west. And by the end of the century, the railroad had, for the first time, made tourism possible for many. Welcome to our journey along the South Rim of the Grand Canyon. The South Rim is renowned for its stunning views and accessible vantage points, making it the perfect introduction to the grandeur of the Grand Canyon. Jackie and I hope you enjoy the spectacular views, as we did on our Four Corners vacation in September 2023. Located along the South Rim's edge, El Tovar is one of the most iconic lodges in the Grand Canyon. Its prime location provides guests with direct access to breathtaking canyon views. From the hotel's vantage points at the South Rim viewing areas, you're treated to expansive panoramic views of the Grand Canyon. The vista encompasses the dramatic drop of the canyon walls and the vast, open expanse of the canyon floor below. The view highlights the canyon's geological strata, showcasing the colorful and intricate layers of rock formations that have been sculpted over millions of years. The different hues, ranging from deep reds and oranges to lighter creams and browns, are vividly visible. The views from El Tovar can be particularly stunning during sunrise and sunset. The changing light casts dramatic shadows and enhances the canyon's colors, creating picturesque and ever-changing scenery. The hotel's location allows you to enjoy the surrounding natural beauty, including the dense forested areas that contrast with the stark, open expanses of the canyon itself. El Tovar Hotel, built in 1905, adds a historic and elegant touch to the experience. Its architecture and décor reflect the early 20th century style, blending with the natural grandeur of the Grand Canyon. The view from El Tovar Hotel provides a classic and sweeping perspective of the Grand Canyon, blending the awe-inspiring natural landscape with the historic charm of one of the Grand Canyon's most esteemed lodges. Our first stop is at Powell Point, memorializing John Wesley Powell's first trip down the Colorado River in 1869. Powell, an experienced geologist, led the first successful expedition to navigate the Colorado River through the Grand Canyon. Powell's journey established him as a prominent figure in American exploration and science. His reports and maps were instrumental in future explorations and in the eventual settlement and development of the American West. The view from Powell Point provides a wide, open vista of the Grand Canyon, showcasing the vastness of the landscape. You can see the intricate layering of the canyon walls and the interplay of light and shadow that highlights the geological formations. Powell Point offers a clear look at the canyon's layered rock formations, showcasing the different colors and strata that reveal the Earth's history. The contrasting colors of the rocks, from deep reds to lighter tans and creams, are particularly striking. Overall, Powell Point offers one of the many spectacular viewpoints along the South Rim, with a grand perspective that encapsulates the essence of the Grand Canyon's awe-inspiring landscape. Our next stop, on Hermit Road is Hopi Point. Hopi Point is one of the most popular viewpoints on the South Rim of the Grand Canyon, offering expansive and breathtaking views of the canyon. From Hopi Point, you can see a wide panorama that includes a large section of the Colorado River winding far below, 
as well as numerous rock formations, and plateaus that stretch into the distance. The view is characterized by layers of colorful rock strata, with shades ranging from deep reds and oranges to lighter hues of pink, beige, and even purple. Especially during sunrise and sunset and the lighting is particularly dramatic. The vastness of the canyon is fully apparent here, with its sheer drops and distant, rugged landscape providing a sense of awe and scale. You can also see landmarks like Vishnu Temple, the Tower of Ra, and parts of the Tonto Platform. The light and shadows continuously change throughout the day, creating dynamic and ever-shifting vistas that make every visit unique. Hopai Point is known for its unobstructed views both east and west, making it a prime spot for watching sunrises and sunsets, as well as for capturing panoramic photographs. The Abyss is a dramatic viewpoint located along Hermit Road. It is known for its sheer, vertical drop of over 3,000 feet straight down to the Tonto platform, making it one of the steepest and most awe-inspiring vantage points along the rim. From the abyss, you get a striking sense of the canyon's depth and scale. The view is dominated by the vast chasm directly in front of you, with towering cliffs plunging downwards without any visible slope or gradual descent. This creates a profound impression of verticality and emphasizes the immense size of the canyon. The panorama includes sweeping views of the layered rock formations that showcase the geological history of the region, with colors ranging from rich reds and deep browns to lighter tans and grays. The landscape is rugged, with a mix of jagged ridges, mesas, and spires that extend far into the distance. In the distance, the Colorado River can sometimes be seen winding through the canyon, though it is far below and often obscured by the canyon's intricate rock formations. The abyss provides a more intimate and less crowded experience compared to some other viewpoints, allowing visitors to fully appreciate the solitude and grandeur of the canyon. This spot is particularly captivating during sunrise and sunset when the low-angle light enhances the textures and colors of the canyon walls casting long shadows that add depth and dimension to the already stunning view. Pima Point offers one of the most expansive and breathtaking views of the canyon. Pima Point is known for its panoramic vistas and stunning perspective of the Colorado River. Pima Point is one of the many scenic viewpoints along the south rim of the Grand Canyon, located on the Hermat Road. It offers one of the most expansive and breathtaking views of the canyon, known for its panoramic vistas and stunning perspective of the Colorado River. You can see the river winding far below, and on quiet days, the roar of the river's rapids, particularly Hermit Rapids, can be heard from this vantage point. The view from Pima Point provides an almost 360-degree panorama, allowing you to see miles into the distance, including other points along the rim and across to the North Rim. Directly below Pima Point is Hermit Basin, a rugged and intricate area that adds to the dramatic scenery. Overall, Pima Point is a fantastic location for appreciating the vast scale, beauty, and serenity of the Grand Canyon, making it a must-visit viewpoint for photographers, hikers, and nature enthusiasts. The view at Pima Point stretches across a wide expanse of the canyon, showcasing layers of colorful rock formations that change hues with the shifting sunlight. The rock strata reveal millions of years of geological history, with reds, oranges, and browns creating a vibrant tapestry. Pima Point offers one of the best views of the Colorado River from the South Rim. You can often see the river winding far below, and on quiet days, the roar of the river's rapids, particularly Hermit Rapids, can be heard from this vantage point. Pima Point is an excellent spot for both sunrise and sunset. As the sun moves across the sky, the play of light and shadow dramatically transforms the canyon, highlighting its depth and contours. Jackie and Hank hope you enjoyed our journey along the south rim of the Grand Canyon during our Four Corners vacation in September 2023. Unfortunately, we must leave the Grand Canyon, 
travel east and experience all four corners all at once under our feet. By the way, the four corners are the states of Arizona, New Mexico, Colorado, and Utah, and they all have a common point. See you there soon.